Good afternoon and welcome to the OFC home of football, Takahu Okiwa in Auckland, New Zealand, for the official draw for the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2024. My name is Andrew Dewhurst and I'm joined today by former Solomon Islands international Henry Faaroto. Henry, thanks for joining us for the draw today. How exciting to see the next generation of footballers come through in this Under-19 Championship. Uh, thank you, Andrew, for having me. And like you said, it is exciting. I think um, there's a lot of talent that comes out from the Ocean region. And, you know, what better place to come and showcase their talent and ability at this championship. Is there something a little different about under-19 football? Uh, a little naivety, perhaps? Uh, a little more freedom sometimes in the way they play? Oh, of course, yeah. There'll be um, some, you know, some form of na na naivety in there and um, a bit of, uh, you know, nervous as well. Uh, but I think, you know, I think it's a very good opportunity for the young kids to come out and, you know, express themselves. Yeah, it's going to be a great tournament. Thanks, Henry, for joining us uh, for the draw. This year's OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2024 will be held in Samoa from July 7 to 20. The seeding for the draw shall be based on the final ranking of the teams from the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2022, with teams drawn from three pots. In pot A, we have New Zealand and Fiji. Pot B has New Caledonia, Tahiti, Solomon Islands and Samoa. Pot C includes Papua New Guinea and the winner of the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2024 qualifying. The draw shall be conducted so that each group shall be comprised of one of the teams from Pot A, two of the teams from Pot B and one of the teams from Pot C. The draw will begin with Pot C. The balls in Pot C will be emptied completely before we move on to pot B and pot A. Teams drawn from each pot will be allocated to the group sequentially, firstly to A, then B. Thus, the first team drawn will be placed in group A, the next team drawn in group B, and so on until all pots are emptied. The position that each team occupies in a, a group will be determined based on the pot from which it is drawn. Thus, teams from pot C will go to position 4. Teams from pot B will occupy positions 3 and 2 in sequential group order. Uh, then the teams from pot A will go to position 1. I'll now ask you, Henry, to begin the draw, and we're going to commence with pot C. qualifying winner. So we're yet to know the identity of course of the qualifying winner but uh, when they are known they will go into group A and now for the second ball from pot C. Papua New Guinea. Papua New Guinea will go into group B. We now move on Henry to pot B. Four balls in this one to be drawn. Solomon Islands. Solomon Islands uh, go into Group A. <coughs> A reminder that we will empty this pot before we move on to the final pot. Samoa. Samoa will go into Group B. Tahiti. Tahiti will play in Group A. And the final ball now from Pot B. New Caledonia. New Caledonia will go into Group B. Thanks, Henry. Let's move on to our final pot now with two balls to be drawn. Fiji. Fiji will go into Group A, leaving one ball to be drawn.
New Zealand. New Zealand's the last uh, nation to be drawn. Now the teams finishing first and second in each group will qualify for the semi-finals with teams finishing in third and fourth contesting the playoff for fifth place and seventh place respectively. The winner of the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship and the runner-up will qualify for the FIFA Under-20 World Cup in 2025. To confirm, here is the complete draw for the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2024 to be played in Samoa from the 7th to the 20th of July. In Group A, Fiji, Tahiti, Solomon Islands and the qualifying winner. In Group B, New Zealand, New Caledonia, Samoa and Papua New Guinea. Thanks Henry for joining us and uh, helping us uh, with the draw and thanks everyone watching uh, the official draw for the OFC Under-19 Men's Championship 2024. Of course, we wish all the very best to the teams competing later this year.